Hello everyone and uh, welcome to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Mohammed. We continue with our training where we prepare for Elastic Certified Observability Engineer exam. And in the two or in the previous video uh, or videos, we uh, we covered the two topics, uptime and metrics. And uh, in the next uh, uh, videos, we will we will cover a new topic, which is logging. We will start with uh, with installation of Elastic Agent and uh, we start with uh, collecting uh, the logs. Right. With that being said, let's jump to our environment. Um, so to do um, the installation of Elastic Agents, uh, you have to go to Fleet, and here we have our Fleet server. Right. Um, now, since I did the same steps as I did here in the uh, metrics, so it's gonna be the same. I will just uninstall the Elastic Agent and uninstall the Fleet server and do the configuration again for you guys to learn how to do. Uh, how to do the installation so i will do i will do uh in enroll the agent the agent and remove the agent immediately so i will do this and we give it a few seconds to um to do the configuration and now as you can see there is no uh there is no agent here this is the first step the other step if you google and install elastic agent uh, from uh, edge hosts so you um, so it's gonna be the same steps but just to make sure that um, we are in the same uh, version we are in 8.8 .8, so it's the same steps I'm in Mac OS this is the command if you are in Linux or Windows this is the steps to do to uninstall the agent for me I will do this I will uninstall it from here I have the command line uh, from here uh, one second I will Perfect. So I will do the command. This is the password. Yes, I will uninstall the agent. And here we go. The uh, elastic agent has been installed. Now let's do the steps again. And um, like I will add agent. Okay. Add fleet server first because we don't have now a fleet server. This is the uh, uh, the name of the uh, fleet server and the uh, the address. Click continue. Here you will get the uh, <coughs> the command line to install uh, the fleet server. Then you copy the fleet server installation commands from here. You paste, and it will do. It will download the uh, the package first, unzip it, and do the installation of fleet server. Right. We give it a few seconds to do the installation. With a, uh, in me meanwhile, I will. Also explain something that I did uh, explain previously in the uh, in this video, which is uh, when you install the Elastic or when you install the Fleet uh, server, you don't need to you don't need uh, to install the uh, Elastic agent on the same host. It's already there. If you want to install the uh, Elastic agent in another host, then you uh, you will get another commands that we're gonna see next from here. And from there, you can install the Elastic Agent. But for our lab environment, for our use case now, we don't need uh, the installation of the uh, Elastic Agent. Why? Because it's already included in the Fleet Server. I hope this is clear. So let's just give it permission. And give it also a few seconds. Now it's checking. All right. All right, well, let's see, it's taking a bit, let's check from here. So once uh, the installation is done, we're going to see a, a green flag from here or the uh, uh, the connection between the Elasticsearch and the fleet server is uh, is confirmed and it will be, it will be green from here. All right, let's see if it's downloading the package now or what it's doing so we have the package now uh, it will do the uh, the installation now <coughs> perfect i see a notification on my machine that's uh, the fleet server and the elastic agency is running in background and here we can see the logs is coming so the logs in like uh, if there is an issue or if there is any warning or error you will be able to see uh, the problem here 
and it will help you to troubleshoot or to fix the issue directly from here and uh, in our case is uh, successfully uh, installed and start the elastic agent as you can see now as you as you can see it's like the green uh, flag so now as i explained previously if we want to do the installation in another host then we click continue and we go and do the installation of elastic agents otherwise if it is the same machine then you don't uh, then you don't need to do the uh, the installation okay now we will uh, do the installation of elastic agent in another uh, in another machine so you click on add agent and here you go to uh, to the command lines so here we have windows you copy the command i will uh, paste it in another machine i have uh, another windows machine here so i will do the uh, installation give me one second like this here we go so i will copy paste the same commands right so here it will choose the uh, it will download this version and it will do the installation so give it a few seconds we will see uh, if there is any issue or uh, if this will work I do yes. Perfect. So as you can see here, we we see the green uh, uh, flag, which in is uh, successfully installed. So if we do that, just close, and here we go. Uh, we see the uh, the new machine is coming. Uh, if you just give it a few seconds, it will be healthy here and we will be able to see the logs and the metrics and uh, everything. Right. With that being said, uh, let me know in the uh, comment section if you have any question. Uh, we'll see you or we'll see you in the next video.